Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how this $89 mini player works. We, I had one, another video for a $59 kit. This is a $89 kit. Uh, and the difference is between the $59 and $89 kit is that $59 kit, it just got a fixed power supply that you can just gold plate or silver plate. The $89 kit, it has an adjustable power supply that you can, you can just adjust the voltage. It's um, like from between three volts to 12 volts. So for example, let's say um, the gold solution, our gold solution used between four to eight volts. So if you want to plate it, we, you can set it up um, anywhere from four and a half to seven and a half volt or even nine volt it will work now if you want to let's say you have a stainless steel and you want a gold plate you must first apply a stainless steel activator and then gold plate so what you do you just set the voltage um, you can set it between four and five volt for a stainless steel so you just turn it and set it let's say four and a half volt and plate it on the fifty nine dollar kit you won't be able to do it since it's not an adjustable power supply now another difference between the eighty nine and fifty nine dollar kit is that fifty nine dollar kit you can buy it with 24k gold, 18k, 14k, rose gold, or silver solution. $89 kit includes this uh, adjustable power supply, includes gold solution and silver solution. Now you have an option to purchase a different um, setup, like you can get this with gold solution, 24k gold with rose gold solution, or 18k with rose gold, or if you played in on a stainless steel, so you need a stainless steel activator, you can purchase the one with the gold with the stainless steel activator. So you will have both when you get it, you can plate your parts. Now process it's the same as the $59 kit to gold plate or, or silver plate so what I'm just gonna show you how, how it works well I'm gonna I have the voltage since as I said the gold it works uh, our gold solution works between 4 to 8 volt so I'm gonna set it um, I can set it like four and a half five volt even seven and a half so I'm just gonna put it on on um, five volt what you do you just plug your power su supply in and plug the power supply okay now this is 24 karat gold this is rose gold so what you need to do if you want process to sit faster you can heat up this in a microwave for about 30 seconds. You take the cap off and um, just put it in a microwave. Now, um, always, these golds are non-hazmat. I explained it before. They don't contain any cyanide, they say. But you always um, be recommend to use a, a disposable gloves. You might have an allergy, skin allergy or something, so it's better to use it. So what you do again, you dip your part inside of the solution. Now, at the same time, you're going to dip the tip of the anode in a solution. You have to be careful that this tip doesn't touch the part. Uh, then gold will start bubbling, that means it's just applying. Keep it for 20 seconds and then pull it out. Check it out. If the gold is bonded, you're done. If it's not, add them for another um, 10 seconds. Um, you can't keep longer. If you keep too long, then the gold start burning and it will take you, turn your part to like dark brownish color. Um, this is a rose gold. 
it's already bonded. I, I'm sure, um, hopefully you can see it. Um, nice color. Um, now, the same thing goes with the 24K gold. Now, every time you're using different solutions, just um, rinse your plating anode. Um, if it's dirty, just get a scotch pad and just clean it up. Now, you c let me see, I think this is one of the coins, it's already polished. Be sure your, your parts are polished, have a mirror shine. If you have a mirror shine, then your parts will be um, really shiny when you apply the gold. This is, I, I think it's a Mercedes keychain. I'm just going to use this. I'm not sure. I think this is nickel plated. Um, dip it in there. At the same time again, dip the tip of anode. Be sure they don't touch each other. You can move it around. already bonded. This is 24 karat gold. Now I'm not sure um, we didn't even, this was anyway polished but um, there it is. 24k gold. Now um, as I said um, always use disposable gloves. Be sure your parts don't touch each other but the plating anode won't touch the, your part. If it uh, touches your part, that means you're connecting the positive and negative together. Uh, any questions or you want to purchase this kit, um, I'm going to put it in the description. It's www.beckerindustries.com. There will be a phone number too. If any question, you can go visit the website and send a message or just give a call. Thank you for watching.